fish on. I mean, it's big, big. Gosh, I hope you don't spoil me. She just realized she was hooked. Oh, no, 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 no. I've never felt a fish that big. We are at the river today. We're gonna be using nothing but corn to try to catch some river giants. We got some circle hooks, tiny little circle hooks. We're gonna put some corn on there and get it casted out and see if we can get some monsters. It's amazing what you can catch with corn. Put our rod holders in the ground. Out there toward the middle. We just got that out. We're gonna sit and wait and see what happens. First confirmed bite on the white pole. And they said it looked like something was pulling that, but it could have been the current. We don't have the heaviest sinkers on. Probably use heavier. Yeah, because did you cast that up there? Yeah. It's down here. Oh what was that? I think it's a corner. Definitely got our first hit. Now we just need our first fish to get hooked. He stole all the corn. A shell? That's a first. Well, didn't get spoiled. Okay. Pulling. Yeah. He might get caught up in this other line. I might need you to reel it in. It's gonna be a while before he comes in. There he is. Fight. He's big. Right. Oh my god. <laughs> Listen to that drag. Whew. Yes. Good god. Perfect hook set. It's a 15 pound fish. 30 inches long on the dot. Beautiful baby back in. The girth on this fish is insane. Look at this. There she goes. She was ready to take off the moment we got her. And that is what a can of corn gets you. She's so cute. Look, that's the oh, first Yes, slime. I have slime all over me. We what a fight that was. Yeah. Anyways, slime all over my see if we can get one more. We'll get another line out there. If not, we'll be out another day because it is super cold and we're soaked and slimy and muddy now. Part slime all over me. We're going to get another line out. It's in your hair. It's everywhere. She got her carp juices all over me. That's okay. We didn't expect to stay clean or anything like that. You're good. See if we can get fish number two. We're not gonna put this one back out there unless we retie it, which we're probably not gonna be out here much longer. It's really cold. That carp got us gross and splashed us. And this has some frays in it and it's not worth the carp getting hooked and this breaking off and being stuck in its mouth, so. One rod it is. One rod it is. Cause I don't feel like retying. I'm still shaking just being the net man. My adrenaline was like through the roof. So I can only imagine how you felt reeling that in. It was it looked fun. So we got another line out. We are freezing. You can see how red my nose is, plus I'm sunburnt. We're gonna wait a little bit longer and see if we can get another one, but if not, we will come back out another day and add to this little vlog. But I just wanted to take a moment to say, I feel like carp is a species of fish that is uh, very underrated. And I'm not too sure why that is. They fight so hard. And I'm pretty sure they're a member of the goldfish family, aren't they? Yeah, they yeah, I think so. And just something about them is like they give this gentle giant vibe 
that I just really like. I don't know. I think they're a lot of fun and it's crazy. You can catch something that big with just a piece of corn or a few pieces of corn in our case. But anyways, we're going to wait on this. Hopefully we get another one. That was a bite. Just got this back out there. It's already getting big. What's happening is you got a carp swimming around your line. It just knocked the line. He's looking at that bait. Oh, oh, it's on. All right, take your time. He's gonna pull you, he's gonna jerk you. Make sure your drag is set right. Oh, he come off. The drag was too tight. Yep. We just had a monster spit the hook. The fish felt very heavy though. I mean, I can't say that it was bigger than the one Maddie just caught, but it definitely felt heavy. So, <sighs> still a good sign though, even though it sucks to lose a fish. We're gonna get some more corn on and get it back out here. Yeah, like we're not biting that corn anymore. We saw what you just did to Heather. And God bless Becky. She got abducted. <laughs> yes. Is he on? Yes, he is. Yes, he should be. This one feels much smaller than the last one, but that's okay. Oh no, maybe he ain't, maybe he ain't small, he ain't small. He ain't small. I don't think he knew he was hooked. Does it feel like you're able to keep him tight? You can't really muscle them in. They just do what they want. Maybe a little tighter, you think? He's real big. I only did a little bit. Don't pull him so hard. Just kind of let him. He's my guy. I also don't want him to be able to tangle me. I mean, it's big, big. Uh -huh. Oh, popped off. What did I do wrong? It popped off when you pulled him up. You can't really pull them in. They're so heavy. You just kind of have to guide them. You're right. Another fish popped off, and I do believe that's my fault. I tried to muscle that fish in, and it, it was just so heavy. It was burning my arm muscles already. Yeah, it does. <laughs> that was a tank of a fish. So I'm going to learn from that, and I'm going to just be a little more gentle with the next fish and not muscle them so much. I'm shaking. That was a heavy fish. I've been carp fishing like twice before. So, I'm learning. All right. This is very good practice. All right, let's see if we can do that again. I've never felt a fish that big on the other end of the line. It made my heart stop. I was like, it ain't that big. And then I felt, <laughs> I was like, yes, it is big. I got a human down there pulling on the line. <laughs> That's what it felt like a person in scuba diving gear, like crazy. Stole the meal and popped the hook off. Okay, okay, she get bit. We're just gonna wait for the takedown and not not get crazy. I swear if I lose another fish. What was going through my mind is, oh my gosh, what if it gets me like wrapped up? I need to be able to pull it this way. I see, cause it's so heavy. Getting lots of bites though. It's like the sun came out and the bite actually heated up. I thought for sure the overcast conditions would be better. So we're gonna reel in and check the calm. Nuh-uh, he's on I think. Okay. I thought I had a fish. I gotta sight it. Well, that's how they feel. Like you ruin a tree in. Our hook got bent. Cause I got snagged and thought it was a fish. I set the hook on a log. But in my defense, me setting the hook on a log, that's what they feel like. I was like, damn, she gonna break the ball. I was like, I ain't losing this one. All right, last try. Here we go again. get this fish all right we got our pole out oh already already getting the big bites that took no time <laughs> poking his head up little cutie just floating downstream I thought I was, gonna get some was that a bite yeah we're getting some action we might get opportunity number three Maybe. Maybe, yeah. Yeah, he ain't got the hook yet, but he's biting. That sun is so bright. It was overcast all day. Now, bright and sunny. Check it, because it was getting bites. Still has some corn left. Let me put some more corn on this, and I'll get them both casted out. I hate that I missed this fish, but... 
I've had fun with this. All right, let's get this pull out and we're gonna give it about 15 minutes and we're out of here. Two tries right here. We're not gonna be out here much longer because even though the sun is starting to poke out, it's still really cold. So that's probably gonna be our last try right there. This one's getting bit, guys. Is there a fish on it? I don't think so yet. It's really tugging at it though. Well, still getting bites. This white pole getting hit pretty hard. Just got hammered on this black pole. The white pole hasn't got any more action. He's pulling it, you see? White one. Huh. We might double up, Maddie. This white one's really getting hit. Yeah, white might be on. Ain't on yet. Both poles have gotten hit again. Just when we thought the bite was. And here comes the train. And here comes the train. So usually when a train passes, is when we get a fish. I'm gonna reel this one in. I'm trying not to make the same mistakes. You still feel them? Yeah. All right, just take your time. Gosh, I hope you don't spool me. It's gonna be a minute. Oh, my heart's flying. It's okay. It ain't as big as the last one. Okay. I can tell you that, but that's okay. Yeah. I'm just happy to land something. It so takes a little do. while. It's okay. You just keep fighting them. Gonna probably have to get on that rock. Oh, I'm gonna get them. Don't you worry. Goes again. God, they pull so hard. What a fighter. Taking my time because I don't want to lose another. So, right here, heavy. He's big. Arm get tired. Gosh. Sorry, right, take your time. I'm taking my time. I don't want to break off. Oh. Yeah, you don't want to break off. Gosh. What a fighter. What a fighter. Powerful fish. Mm -hmm. Powerful fish. Gotta get tired eventually, right? Yeah. See yeah. the bubbles? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whew. What a powerful awesome. fish. He's big. Yeah, I don't see him yet. Oh, I see him. I see him. Come on, baby. All right, can you get him? Not yet. All right, right here, right here, right here. Go. Yes! Woo! Thank you, God. Y'all, I am shaking right now. What a fight. My wrist. Um, all right, Maddie's got this baby in the water. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the pliers. What a fight. That was insane. Let's get this pretty baby unhooked. Hi, ah, sweetheart. I know, I know. You are such a good fighter. Hey, ain't no sense in it. All right, we're keeping her in the water while we get ready for some pictures. And uh, then we're gonna let her go. Or him, we don't know. Finally, after two missed opportunities, let's let this beautiful baby go. Look at the tail on that. It's insane. Thank you so much, beautiful. I'm just gonna kinda 
Oh, she took off. They're so big and heavy. Can't even like gradually let them go. You're just gonna let them go, you know? That is awesome. Now we gotta go because we're starving. Day number two, we're out here on the river again. As you can see, it's a lot sunnier than it was the last time. It's a lot warmer. We already got some corn casted out. So we're keeping our fingers crossed. We'll see if the carp like bright sunny days. Just got our first hit of the day on this white pole right here. We've not really had a pole casted out, but five, 10 minutes. So that's a good sign. are getting hit. Getting a good bite on it now. Had to yell for Maddie. She's over there bass fishing. I'm like, oh, your rod about to take off. Fish on. Uh -huh. She just realized she was hooked. <laughs> uh, I don't know how good it is. I have like no bank. Yeah, I don't think she's little. I think she just realized she was hooked. <laughs> Fighting hard, huh? <sighs> yeah, we were just sitting there talking, and then all of a sudden the black hole's like going down. Right in front of Here she comes. What a fighter. She'll take off again, isn't it? be a good net man here. Oh, no, she's not little. She's not little. <laughs> she's big. Just got her in the net. What a beast. I think this is definitely the longest one. Fish is almost 20 pounds. This fish is probably about 32 inches long. She weighs almost 20 pounds. A little under, 19 something. Just a freaking powerhouse of a fish. And she felt little at first. Yeah, she felt little at first. I don't think she knew she was hooked. And this is what eats corn. I just, I can't stress that enough. I've said that so many times now, but it's crazy to catch almost a 20 pound river monster on corn. All right, let's get some pictures and then we're gonna get this beautiful baby's release. It's time to return this giant to her home and yes she's uh, bleeding but that's just where the hook pierced her the water will wash that off 22 and a half inch girth wow i'm a slimy too but it was so worth it i'm not gonna be out here much longer because somebody dropped our corn Hey, <laughs> we got some on this pole right here. She's you gonna cast that out. Board. Yeah, and we'll um, get it out into the water so the fish can eat it and the ants will leave it alone. It's this line. Hold on, let me come back down to the top. There she is. Oh, no, 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 no. Walk her this way. In the net. Oh. I don't think she knew she was hooked. I don't think she realized she was hooked. Hey, girl, you hooked. <laughs> you are hooked. You did get hooked. There we go. We're just going to lift her out of the water long enough for a picture. Mm, bigger than you think. This is your PB. What is it? 16 point something. 16.72. Almost a 17 pound fish. What a good well, way to end the it. The net weighs a pound. So she's 15 pounds. 15 and a half in the net. Wow, guys. What a beauty. We're gonna get some pictures of this girl and uh, catch you back on the release. All right, guys, we're gonna get this big, beautiful, this big, beautiful creature back into the water. 
And now this is probably going to be our last fish of the video. So thank you so much, Beauty Queen. You are going to wrap it up for us. Go back home. wrap it up for this video we hope you enjoyed it we gotta get home and shower because we are disgusting and, uh, we'll catch you on the next one peace